Yo, what's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. Hope everyone's having a Merry Christmas today. Remember, it's not about giving, it's about... No, I always get it mixed up. It's not about receiving, it's about giving. It's not about receiving, it's about giving, so make sure to spend time with family, friends, have a good time. Anyways, before we get into today's video, I want to say I'm sorry I haven't uploaded a video in literally two weeks. The reason for that is because we got into a car accident, or should I say a truck accident. We crashed our brand new truck that we got like, what baby, like three weeks ago, right? Oh yeah, it was so devastating. <sighs> If you guys follow me on Instagram, you guys saw a picture of what the truck looks like now. We can't drive it, we have no vehicle. So if you guys want me to make a story time video explaining what happened, showing you guys video of everything, let me know down below. Anyways, today's video is gonna be pretty exciting because if you guys remember a couple months ago, we started transforming this vending machine into a safe. So we took everything out, we gutted it, we painted the machine yellow. Which, by the way, ever since I uploaded that video, everyone keeps asking me, hi, I'm watch part two of the vending machine transformation. Cuz, if you didn't see that video, I told you guys that one of you watching right now was gonna win this machine once we finish it. It's gonna be the biggest giveaway I've done so far. So, if you guys want a chance to win this machine today, watch the whole video, drop a like, and yeah, let's go ahead and finish it off. What if I got stuck in there? Would you let me out? How would you get stuck? I don't know, it locks inside or something? There is no lock in there. Yeah, look at that, we broke the lock. <laughs> I was supposed to buy another one of these before we made this video so I can lock it, but you know, oh well. <laughs> All right guys, so first things first, before we actually finish off the machine, let's take one last look at the machine and see what we did last time, see what we got left to do. All right guys, before we get started, I want to clarify that just because my sweater says eat me, that doesn't mean you guys can eat me, okay? I'm off limits, only for my girlfriend. That's what I thought. You know, the same thing for her. Don't, you guys can't eat her, only me. <laughs> so this is what the machine looks like, you know, it's pretty big inside, you can fit a whole person in here. So yeah, the whole bottom is rusty, we still gotta wrap it with something, it looks pretty messed up down there. I think all that is from like soda cans popping, you know, they fall on the floor and it gets rusty. I was gonna take the parts off and use them for my vending machines, but you know, it looks a lot better having the parts in there. And it has that feel of like a vending machine. Yeah, it keeps the feel of like the machine, so let's put this back. We got the bill scepter where the bills go, the coin mech for the coins. The only thing I regret is in part one, we actually cut off the power cord so we can't plug in the machine no more. So now these light bulbs are useless, they're not going to be able to turn on, so it kind of sucks, but you know, we can still put some LED lights inside, make it light up. We actually got some markers, so I do want to make some designs on the front of the machine, make it look better, stand out. We actually have this, and no, it's not a little cat tower or nothing, it's actually just a shelf. We wrapped it with carpet. We should have just got one of those cat towers. <laughs> we should have. It would have been Guys, easier. <laughs> it, took the, it took us two hours to wrap this with carpet. We should have literally just got one of those cat towers. So look, what I, what I want to do is put the shelf inside just like that. Um, what do you think? Does it look weird? It looks fine. All right, so the first thing we got to do is of course wrap the whole inside of the machine and I want to do the bottom side first. Just because it's like really dirty, so you actually measured it, right? Yes. What was it? So it's 18 and a half by 34 and a half. So 18 by 34, we got the carpet. Um, so now let's see if we can cut this. All right, there we go. We got the first piece. That took me a long time. That was pretty hard. <laughs> I'm just playing. <laughs> Rita, I'm just Shout out to my girlfriend. She did the first piece. Uh, let's see if it fits. Baby, if it doesn't fit, I'm gonna punch you in your face. It's gonna fit. All right, let's see. For the moment of truth. 
I mean, we can just cut this. You see how it's a little bit too long? It goes all the way back. So yeah, let's just cut this and it should be good. You got this or you want me to do it? I got it. How's it look? Pretty nice carpet. If you guys ever want to come inside, make sure to take your shoes off first, you know, before you, like, never mind. <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that. <laughs> but yeah, we got the first side in. So now let's do all, how many do we have left? Four? Four. So yeah, let's finish off these four and we'll be right back once we're done. What so what happened? What happened? You I forgot good? <laughs> that this one was 55 and a half and I cut 55. So I'm missing half an inch. Oh my god. Look at look at this. Wait, Lucy, put it. Like Dang it, we don't have no material left. Look at this. That's all we have left. And we're missing half an inch on the right side. Alright, so there we go. We are finally done with putting all the material inside of the machine. It took about an hour. It took a long time because some of the some of the pieces were not the right size, so we had to cut up some more. I like how it turned out. Yeah, I, at first I was gonna get like a black material, but I feel like the brown one doesn't look too bad. All right, so what do you think, baby? It's pretty much done. I think it came out pretty good. Uh, we put the last two screws in the machine. <laughs> but now that I'm thinking about it, baby, this looks more like a, a house for a cat than a safe. Does it not? <laughs> Look at this It thing. really does. Yeah. There's a cat tower right there, and then all this Literally. room that they could, they could just be like jumping around the walls. So whoever wins this, if you don't want to use it as a safe and you have a cat, let him live in there. <laughs> just don't close the door. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't close the door. But anyways, now that we have pretty much everything set up, let's run to the store, let's get a bunch of stuff to put inside, and let's finish the vending machine safe. We'll be right back. All right guys, so we made it to Walmart. Let's go inside, let's buy a bunch of stuff for the machine. We gotta get the LED lights, what else? Some long nails for the shelf. The only problem is that there's actually a bunch of people. It's Christmas day, so hopefully it's not packed, and they better have some stuff to buy left. I don't know. Let's go inside and let's see if they got some stuff. We literally got the last one. It's a busy day. All right, baby. Pick your weapon. Which one? And pick wisely, all right? You like that one up there? Yeah. Dang, it's a pretty big one. All right, there you go. Okay, so look, so far we have one of them, of course, she got the biggest one. Wait, you know what? Get one of each. Really? Did that hurt? <laughs> Did it hurt? Yeah. If it wasn't for that camera hiding. <laughs> what? Well, here, you can do it back to me. Oh my gosh, this hurts. 
work. Okay, please don't show me back, baby, okay? Wait, how do you do it? I was just gonna test it out and Did see I put if it, it works. No, don't. I want to test it out no, too. No, no, it works. It works? Baby, if you shoot that at me, I swear. So we are finally back and this is all the stuff that we're gonna be putting into the safe. So we got a bunch of, you know, Nerf toys. I feel like I gotta say toys. If I say the other word, I'm gonna get demonetized or you know how YouTube is nowadays. We got some candy just in case, you know, people, you wanna hide your candy from your family. Perfect situation. <laughs> we also got a bunch of lights. That way we can put them on the shelves and you know, each section is lit up and you can see everything, especially at night. We also got this big one, which it took four batteries and look at this. You can, can you even see it on the camera? <laughs> no. It's on right now and you can't even see it. So hopefully once I put it into the machine, you can see it a lot better. Of course, we do gotta put some money in there cause it is a safe, so we gotta keep our money secure. This is about like, how much was it? You're the one that rolled it up. It was like 600 and quarters. We got a few dollars in there, uh, but yeah, there we go. We're gonna be putting all this into the safe and finish it off. After so many hours, after so many days, yes, days, if you guys haven't noticed, we, we've, been, we've been working on this vending machine for four days straight. Since Christmas Eve. Yeah, since Christmas Eve. We had to wear the same outfit every single day just for the video. It still smells not, it doesn't no, smell bad. No, 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 let's not go there. <laughs> Anyways, the machine is finally done. Should we show them? Let's do it. You ready? Yeah. Boom, so there we go. This is the front of the machine. Um, first of all, baby, look, guys, I know a baby can do this. You know, it's not the best designs out there. I'm not good at art, okay? So don't make fun of me. But yeah, basically, we did a bunch of, you know, designs on the front just to not make it look boring because it was pretty much just yellow. Which didn't look bad at all. It didn't look bad, but it was too open, too blank, you know? Yeah. Actually, my favorite part on the outside is the logo. So we did trace the logo just so it can stand out better and I think it worked. Looks pretty good. Also over here on the right side uh, with the logo, we you know did a bunch of designs. We colored in some of them and yeah, that's what the side looks like. Oh yeah, we also put a brand new lock inside because we did drill it out last time. So we got a new lock and some keys. But yeah, let's go ahead and open it. And there we go. That's the inside of the machine. What do you think? It looks, looks good. Awesome, baby. It really does look good. Look at this. So look, the point of this video was to turn a vending machine into a safe, and we I feel like we did a pretty good job. Didn't we? I'm amazed on how good we did. Like, look, we got some shelves in here. We got, you know, some toys on the walls. Since it is a safe, of course, you know, you can hide your money inside. We got cash, we got coins. You can also put your important documents, like a passport, okay? <laughs> Folders and stuff, in case you have like important stuff you wanna take care of or whatever. It is kind of empty, cause we literally didn't know what to put. I mean, we don't have nothing to hide. <laughs> we really don't. <laughs> we did put the lights on the side, just because it was a lot easier than putting them on top. And also inside of the shelves, we do got some lights inside. Like, if I turn them off, it looks dark, right? Yeah. We also got an extra compartment down here on the bottom of the machine. That's where the compressor used to be at. I mean, if you have like a, a big safe or something that you want to put down there. A safe in a safe. <laughs> yeah, a safe inside of a safe. But yeah, overall, comment down below. What do you guys think? Is the machine fire? Is it trash? And one of you guys watching right now is going to win this machine today. Okay, I'm going to say the details at the end. And there it is. So now let's close up the safe. 
We got the lock in there. And there it is. If somebody goes into your house and tries to break in, the last thing they're gonna think is that there's stuff inside, you know? But anyways, that's pretty much it. I am gonna leave the machine in here for now. So let me go ahead and close this. Like I said in the beginning of the video, we uh, crashed our truck. So this is our truck for the next few days. <laughs> Doesn't look like a truck. <sighs> like, I haven't I haven't been in a car in forever. Ever since my white car. Do you remember how to use the key to turn on a car? No. <laughs> we have pushed to start on the truck, so it's been a while since I've used the key. All right, now let's go home and we'll talk about that giveaway. And boom, there we go guys. We are finally home. I'm actually so tired from working on that machine for the last few days. But now that we're finally home, I know you guys are waiting for the giveaway. You guys want to know how can you guys win this machine? Well, first of all, since it is going to be a very expensive giveaway, because of course it is a vending machine and I think to ship it around the US is like, like 500 if not more. So. I'm sorry, but this giveaway is gonna be for the US only. There, there's just no way I can ship a vending machine to another country without paying like thousands of dollars. But besides that, if you're in the US, then you're good. Uh, so now let's talk about the giveaway. This giveaway is actually gonna be very simple. There's three rules. Rule number one is you have to go follow me on Instagram. I do have the link down below. Go click the link, follow me, and there you go. You get the first rule done. Rule number two is as soon as this video goes live, I'm actually going to be posting a picture on Instagram about the giveaway. And then you got to click on the picture and tag two people. It can be anybody, your friends, your parents, your brothers, literally anybody. And that's pretty much it. Rule number three is just wait and see if you win. And since it is a pretty big giveaway, I'm going to pick a winner in seven days. I'm going to pick a random person on the comment section. So make sure after seven days to check your messages and see if you won. But besides that, that's pretty much it for the video. I hope everyone did enjoy. Good luck to everyone. Again, go follow me on Instagram. The link is down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. What are you doing? <laughs> My baby crazy. <laughs> <laughs>